The eruption of Kilauea volcano continues at the summit caldera, and while the alert level was downgraded on Monday evening from warning to watch, lava is still erupting from multiple vents and filling the lava lake below in the crater. Today, USGS Hawaiian Volcano Observatory released some new video showing the active lava fissures. Scientists say the west vent continues to be the most vigorous source with occasional bursts up to 20 meters or 66 feet. The lava lake has risen to the base of the west vent where a spatter rampart is being built. Over the past 24 hours, the lava lake level has risen approximately 1 meter or 3 feet. Seismicity and volcanic gas emission rates are still elevated. Sulfur dioxide readings remain high with preliminary measurements on October 4th of approximately 7,000 to 9,000 tons per day. Summit instruments continue to record deflationary tilt. The USGS published this reference map on October 5th. It shows the location of the two eruptive vents that were active at the time the map was made. It also shows the position of several islands on the lava lake surface that were present during the previous five-month eruption. Some of these islands were initially drowned by lava but later floated back to the top. The surface of the lava lake is now at approximately 2,530 feet, or 771 meters above sea level. Active lava is now visible from two public visitor overlooks in Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. All lava activity remains confined to the summit within the national park, and no unusual activity has been observed in the East Rift Zone. 